So we're at the Rakuten Open Round Customer Experience Centre here in Weybridge in the UK. The centre has just officially opened today. And I'm here with uh, Nastasi Karaiskos, who is the Managing Director of Rakuten Symphony UK. And uh, Nastasi, thanks so much for joining us. So can you just tell us exactly what you've got here in this centre? Yeah, absolutely, Ray, and, and welcome, welcome to the opening of, uh, of our new centre. It's a, a proud day for Rakuten, Rakuten Symphony and Rakuten Symphony UK um, to showcase our technology and what we've, what we've built here. Um, so we have the interoperability capability to develop um, our software and hardware here that it will be deployed into the field for our customers, as well as testing of equipment from a range of new ORUs and RUs that will, will be deployed into the field. Uh, we have an installation here being built for our cloud and automation platform, SimWorld, um, as well as our NGDU uh, and CU platform. Okay. And so basically, who do you expect to come in here and work with you? I mean, you've already got some vendor partners here. Uh, how many companies are already involved and what other kind of companies will come in and be part of this testing and, and interoperability process? Yeah, yeah, a wide range of partners already from the ecosystem um, working with us to get this center set up. And over the next few months, we've got workshops with customers that we, uh, we support directly. So the operators, the MNOs, three of the four UK MNOs are existing customer of ours, and we're helping them supporting their O-Round journey. Um, we also have systems integrators and services partners who also uh, support the MNOs around the UK and Europe, who also um, will be using this facility and will be working with them to support their customers. Um, I also see us using this facility to host um, local universities. We are partnering with the University of Surrey, which is just uh, a short journey away from this center. And they have their own 5G and 6G uh, innovation center. And we hope to, to share learnings from both of those centers and hope to encourage um, local graduates to come in, uh, learn about Open RAN, learn about the telecoms industry and encourage them uh, you know, uh, to, jo to join us and, and think about a future career in, in the industry. Okay. And, and so what will actually come out of this? Because it's not just a case of companies coming in, uh, you know, plugging in either remotely software or some hardware and going, yes, that works, tick a box and go away. This is to actually set up for ahead of real world deployments, isn't it? We certainly have the capabilities to do that. Yes, absolutely. I think, you know, from day one, um, you know, we aim to, we have a replication here, um, connection to our Rakuten Mobile uh, Japan uh, setup. Testing and interoperability has already been completed, um, but we also hope to be able to do that with other operators in the UK and Europe as well. Okay. And then um, finally, just in terms of, of uh, I mean, this is day one. This is a, a long-term facility, isn't it? This is going to, something that's going to be uh, around for, for quite a long time. You know, what, what are customers hoping to get out of this? Yeah, we, cer we certainly hope so. We certainly, uh, that's our vision for this centre, uh, both from a, an internal staff perspective and also, you know, from, from the industry perspective. So I think it's, um, it's a, a centre where we can really work closely with the operators on their requirements, um, building their needs for the future as their networks evolve from 5G to 6G, traditional RAN and then including open RAN. We help to support their automation and operation journey as well. And we have the capabilities to demonstrate as well as build and, and, uh, and deploy services from this site. Okay. And any certification sort of processes happening here that um, you know, can be taken and shown uh, as part of RFI, RFQ processes? Yeah, absolutely. We announced uh, today as well that the certification with Japan and the UK for OTIC has been completed, successfully completed um, between the two centers to support replication and security. Fantastic. Well, Nastasi, good luck, day one. Um, look forward to catching up in the future and finding out how things are developing. Thanks very much. Thank you, Ray.